It was the musical The Blues Brothers that propelled Solomon Burke's best-known hit into global fame. But by the time it came out, he was already a veteran of the soul scene and one of the leading artists on the Atlantic label during the 1960s. Aged 70 and weighing 30 stone, Solomon Burke had taken to performing from a throne at the centre of the stage. He was also a Grammy Award winner, a father of 21 children and a grandfather of 90. Callum May on the life of Solomon Burke. BBC News at three minutes past 12 on X to 1. Chris. Oh, yeah, baby. Lynn. Wait. Like a cloche, don't I you? I love a cloche. Johnny. I don't know what a cloche <laughs> is. And the team getting out of bed earlier to wake up the nation. The 20% bigger Chris Evans breakfast show. Gordon Ramsay on the telephone. Is a large courgette a large courgette or can it become something else when it's large? There's a understanding that they become married. Nothing of the sort. They become a large courgette and that's it. Jay Rayner, can you confirm that, please? Oh, uh, for the sake of it, why not? Yes. <laughs> breakfast begins weekday mornings from 6.30. Good morning, worm catchers. BBC Radio 2. BBC Radio 2.